this is the first time it properly snowed. Möchtest du dann mit dem Spiel? Ja, ihn zu lachen wegen. Kitzel? Nein, so lustige Sachen machen und dann zum Lachen bringen. Okay. Aber dann helf. Mama hat mein Haar. Oh. Hey. Help. Was macht der Bär? This must be the most beautiful winter day um, since winter started because we've not yet had white day. So this is the first time it properly snowed. With so many days in my life being so chaotic and so busy and so stressful, I planned to have an easy day today. So we woke up pretty late, we chilled in bed and then got out of bed late. And one of the breakfasts that I like to make when I just can't be bothered is a peanut butter toast and some Kenyan tea out of tea bags. I love these tea bags because they come in pretty handy when I don't have time to prepare the Kenyan tea the Kenyan way. So thank you so much for Kwetu Shop that we can get these tea leaves here in Germany. The children also get to decide what they want to have for breakfast. So most of the time they would have a toast as well and fruits for Jabbar. As you all know, if you want to keep a tidy home, especially if you have a big family, you have to clean as you go. Can you see how untidy Jabbar's head look like? Yeah, no more because he's going to the barber shop mm -hmm. later. So I'm going to use this that I opened yesterday from my advent calendar. And I'm also going to use this body scrub. Yep, I'm about to get so fresh and my skin so good. One thing about me, I will promise myself to have a chill day, but I will still do stuff. That is one way for me to keep my head from overthinking. So I like to do things with my hands. If it's cleaning, if it's organizing, that keeps my thoughts in one place. So I went ahead and cleaned my beans. They were all in need of cleanup. And I decided to use this bathroom that we do not usually use because it's spacious than in the kitchen. So to clean them, I was using the vinegar cleanser that you can buy from any drugstore. And I also had my Dettol. Yes, so that was going to disinfect them. And also I cleaned the diaper bin. I always always line my beans before uh, putting trash in there but still it's good to disinfect them because all kinds of bacteria and stuff get onto them. <music> beans 
ones i went ahead and cleaned the surfaces that i was using and also put the beans in the shower kind of to dry them off and yes i would also later start doing the laundry as you can see my laundry is almost full after this i went to clean up the baby and change his diapers prepare him for his nap because yes it was nap time <laughs> loves cuddling time so much so i do not usually plan anything during the day really because i know he will want me to be holding him a lot during the day so unless it's activities outside it's hard to plan anything inside the house one look at jazzy's hair was screaming mommy take care of my hair so i was going to take a chance and start undoing her hair in the hope that baby Z would sleep and let me finish off doing her hair before i could do much he was already asking for his meal so i took him and breastfed him first just to make sure that he was not complaining because he's hungry or anything and then i would hope that he will sleep these two are just so so cute together jazzy's protective instinct like came immediately immediately the baby was brought back to the house actually even before like she was she was she was always protecting me when i was pregnant with zed she was always like, no, no, mommy, mommy will not do that. Mommy is pregnant. <laughs> mommy has a belly, uh, has a baby in, his, in her belly. Seeing that he was still uncomfortable even after being fed and all clean, I decided to poke him. And that's the only way I got this baby sleeping for hours. He slept until I was done doing Jazzy's hair. I was even shocked. By this time, Jay and Jabba had gone out and were already back. Come, Jabba. Take my hair. Octopus. Octopus. Take my hair. Wow. That's a holiday. Was du hair schneiden? Yeah. Good. Good sister house. Ha ha. Yeah, it's a good house. I usually try and do Jazzy's hair every three weeks, um, but her hair is quite soft, so it goes untidy pretty fast and owing to the fact that we do not usually have a lot of option with african salons you have to do it by yourself most of the time uh, actually almost all the time so it's quite challenging i do still love doing her hair it's just our time to bond but it's just that we can never really have that quiet time just the two of us which would be so ideal 2000 years later we are back now from taking a shower and washing her hair so we usually check out for styles online and then she tells me which styles she wants to wear do her hair she is allowed to watch her favorite shows and if she likes a snack i would let that happen as well some
someone asked me how I take care of Jazzy's hair and which products I use on her hair so I'm going to say this um, we started combing out Jazzy's hair from day one she had a huge mane of hair when she was born so we used to apply uh, organic coconut oil on her head and then we used to like care for her hair every day so when she got older we, uh, okay yeah when she was a baby we obviously used baby shampoos well when she got older we started going in with Cantu products and at some point we i started using garnier garnier products on her hair so that is where we get our products from and those are available from the local drugstore which is amazing <music> that i can style her hair by myself because if she had to struggle the way i struggled for hairdressers i think um i would at some point give up and shave her head which she doesn't like so i'm really glad i can style her in different ways i am pretty light-handed when braiding do you want to have some evidence She fell asleep, so I just let her sleep, but I continued. Once I was done with the back, it was time for the front and then we would be done. Jay had already gone to work and Jabbar was taking his nap and guess who else was asleep baby said still <music> This was a great day because I managed to do a lot of things and hack them off. So the last thing I did is to put her braids in water so they wouldn't unravel and then style her hair with some beads and we were gonna be done. So voila, her hair is done. She loves it. I love it as well. I think she looks cute after this would be dinner time and then bring the kids to bed this is how much snow we had today i'm really 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 hoping for a white christmas this year we have not had a white christmas in a very long time every time it's christmas the sun is already out again the snow has melted and it's just nah it's just nah after all the kids were in bed i went ahead and gifted myself uh, a gift from my advent calendar so as it was day 10 i opened it up and it was a just check it out enjoying opening up little presents every day and rituals really have good sense which i love so much 
it's just that the sizes sometimes are really small like they're like samples but i still enjoy it follow me on instagram to see what i open on a daily thank you guys so much for always watching my videos for tuning in for liking sharing subscribing i love you all